by the look of them, they're not going to play well. They're, I told you it'd be different. I expected him to start crying as he did uh, on a fight with, <laughs> with uh, Lewis at Wembley before. This is a new one. Executive director, Mark Ratner. Physicians at ringside, lead physician, Dr. Flip Romanski. We've got a show off there. Well, that's the biggest hand he's had in uh, fights in America. The brushes with the law has a lot to do with this, but I have to emphasize, and he's finished giving all this here. Must interrupt uh, this fellow's a judge in Reno, this referee. The commission in Nevada, Mark Ratner, was telling me that uh, McCall was completely uh, of any drugs when they examined him thoroughly a couple of days ago. that both fathers get uh, the drug test afterwards. So now these rehearsing for tossing the cable. She's going to throw that stone. Massive size, stone in it. Must think about his defence, but he mustn't think defensively. He just has to do everything from a sound defence. He's a stepping back from McCall. Oh, now he's tried his right hand now, Lewis, so that's uh, one each. Confused McCall with the jab. Larry Holmes, an aging Larry Holmes, confused him with it. So Lewis wants to do this. He's not jabbing terribly hard with that uh, left hand lead there, Lewis, but it's just range finding. With the left hook. I would just like to see him with the straight shots keep McCall at bay. This is a good positive first round from Lewis. This is as good a first round as we can expect. Yeah, those sort of fluffy edges that he had as an amateur. So Lewis is keeping him out of range. This is an excellent. He wants to keep that concentration. Just keep pumping the jab. A jab confuses Oliver McCall. Well, can hear Harry Glenn? Well, I think he is. I don't think you have to worry about that. No, no fighter can, but particularly when you know that you've been knocked over by your opponent. Lewis's attitude is in the first round. I was worried he'd maybe go to sleep, maybe be thinking too defensively. If you can force Oliver McCall back, then you take half of the way in the bag. And he's getting a round in the bag. Yeah, that's one in the bag. That, that's good to see him calming down there. On the outside of the ropes, he's got a good one of the best trainers in the game. He's a good middleweight, too, who could have been a world champion except for one or two great ones. So, coming up for the second round, then the vacant WBC version of the heavyweight champion. And uh, Jim Watt and I have certainly gave Lewis the opening round. But with that jab, don't let him get to work. He's going to start becoming that little bit desperate. He's going to start making mistakes. He's going to start swinging at Lewis. Then maybe He's back there, Rez, but quite right to do so. Trouble, however, whatever it takes. See, McCall just rushing past the jab. He can't box his way past it. He's now rushing. Well, that, that was a decent shot. He pulled away. Tried to pull away from him, but that landed OK. They, they both landed at the same time. That was poor defensive work from Lewis. Two punches. That was careless once again. Oh, good right hand. Oh, the atomic ball stuff again here. He's he's fearless this character. Yeah, Mills didn't have to be strict about this, shoving the, the forearm in his face. Oh, that uppercut there, that reminded me. Uh, this guy at the moment. Is he, is that, his head's all over the place there, McCall. He didn't know where he was then. Oh, good shot. That, that, that's the way, right through the defence at the moment. Britain is gumshield like mad there, Lewis. We're right on the wing eight from Jim Watt now here. He's punching up to this point in the second round. Better than Lewis's. Oh, they just caught him high with that punch, Lewis, on the side of the head. Stapping a little bit in this round. You know, when he gets back to the jab, he's a bit more authority about him there, Lewis. Questions and points as we get the clappers at the timekeeper alongside us there for the end of the second round. Oh, that, that was a good shot by Lewis Jim, right above us there. Well, that was a close round, that was a tough round for yeah. McCall's punching, that little bit better quality there. Okay, you got to keep your right hand up, your right hand is getting a little sloppy, okay? That's it from McCall, but he came back with good shots of his own, then he launched more attacks after that. At least psychologically, Lewis wasn't done an awful lot of harm in that round. See, that was the upper Yeah, Lewis got some good punches and off that. himself.
But I just felt that McCall. I tell you what, this fellow looks shape, whatever happens now to McCall, you know, she's had three clinics and so forth. He's, he's whipped himself into shape. It shows here, doesn't it? He's got to start banging that punch in there. Or he's keeping his man. A little, a little bit negative, just pumping the jab. But this is all right. Lewis wants some rounds in the bag. I mean, this, I really feel this fight could go all the way. If not all the way, it'll be a long fight. So Lewis wants as many rounds in the bag early. Guy. Good stuff yeah. from Lewis. And now he's, uh, to use a, a boxing term, he's, he's a bit of a governor at the moment. Uh, all right, that's what I'd like to see. Yeah, this is good stuff. Now, I, I emphasize this, this guy, McCall, has never been on the deck. Now, right? And he's sparred endless rounds. Did you see this? Now, this? This is where McCall becomes unpredictable. Lewis has also has room, some room to get a right hand home as well. That's oh, it. Oh, a double that was up well there, Lewis. That's the first time he's actually timed a left hook close in. Real good performance. She Took looked, a punch, but come back with one red. That's all right. He's played his legs a bit there, McCall. Look. Oh, he's <laughs> told you. <laughs> There's nobody like this fella. McCall standing off. And standing off, he has no chance of winning this fight. I have to say, I'm just ignoring this fella. I think he's trying to draw mistakes, a character at times, but he's probably trying to draw mistakes from Lewis doing that. Lewis is looking for single shots, but taking loads. Oh, look at this, look. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Clear round to Lewis, of course. He's hardly landed a good blow here, McCall. Wrong corner, mate. Go the other way. That's he's it. dismissing it, isn't he? It's, 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 you know, there are sorts of criticism about him, mate. Right? He's, he's, no. he's just... He's, I mean, there's no way that's going to take going to make uh, Lewis nervous in any shape or form. But I don't know. So Jim Watts' uh, scorecard then puts Lewis around up. What we're doing is we start the fourth. I don't know why I'm the call. The, the two trainers very Lewis could take a chance and drop a right hand here because Jim, he can't summon power like that. Jim, the referee's going to say something to this. He can't let it. He's got to make he's a move by the crowd. I'm not surprised, McCall. I mean, there's no way he can rattle Lewis by doing this. He's not throwing punches. He's got to get... well, Reg, this is as good as I've seen Lennox Lewis. I know McCall's giving him the... Oh, beautiful punch. Right above us there, Jim. If you'd have missed that, I think we'd have popped that out. We'd have tried. But this guy's fighting, man. I mean, that was a solid right hand. That one glance, but the first one was a solid shot. Interest, Reg. Or if he's just got some crazy plan in his mind about slinging one big right hand again. But uh, I cannot, I don't understand it. Well, I hope he's not getting messy for that. It's not going to help him. Well, we've certainly had two rounds of turn the other cheek, Reg, haven't we? He's trying oh. to step forward. I don't know if he's going to change his mind. But not. we expect better than this. I think he does his defensive now. Lewis shows him a feint. McCall just walks back from him. It's as though he's no intention, Reg, because, uh, I mean, he's not in any danger of being knocked out. He's not taking punches. Lewis is still fairly careful here. But he's, the fight does go late, then fine. Do the right thing. Don't take chances against a danger man until you have to. Not surprisingly, the heavy rollers and the uh, going, going over to uh, McCall saying, "What are they going to say to him?" And he's walking. All and George Benton is not amused. Reggie he has that face he's ready to burst into tears. I mean, yeah. look at his face. It's as though he's disappointed. I'm saying nobody else. It's the opposite. It's as though he's lost interest. I don't know what's going on here. He's corner trying to talk him into it. As we come out for this next round, it's just unbelievable stuff. This. Motion as though he wants to come forward, Reg. I don't know if he does. I hope that's the case here. It's unbelievable. Oh, that will oh, stop him laughing about that right hand punch. And again, he's actually not even looking at the punches coming here. But Lewis, don't don't run into anything. No, this is he's going to stop it. He stopped the fight. This landed on my head. This is unbelievable. Is it, either he stops it because he's taking too many no, punches punch without really, or he stops it because he's not taking part and that has to be a disqualification which could affect the payment of his purse I don't know if that's the same over here I know in British it's, it's, it's all added to it now and poor Lennox Lewis one of his yeah. best performances well, of the year and it's tarnished I mean yeah, he, totally he didn't beat the guy the, the, the guy just quit all the right hands the uppercuts everything Jim, but his victory has been tarnished I think he's disqualified him you know has to be a disqualification that for me no, actually, he didn't quit, Reg. He just, the referee decided to get him out of there. He didn't yeah, even quit. He didn't even retire. To call a halt to this bout, it comes referee declaring a technical knockout at 55 seconds.
around. It's not about his weight, uh, 17 th stone, 13 pounds, but he looks really well. Yeah, that's the it. winner, and now a, a two-time WBC. Right, it's tarnished.